as the green flag is back in the air. 150 laps of racing all comes down to this. Taylor Gray able to hold on to that lead, but will he be able to make it stick out of turn two? Four wide for a second. Something's gonna happen. Daniel dies dirt tracking through there and still holds on to second momentarily. Contact wow. with Jesse Love in that 20. You see the 20. Is that the 20 getting squirrely back there in the pack? It is. Raja Kruth also was up into the uh, front row on the restart. He's back pedaling there in third. Pedaling hard now to get position back. The white flag is out. We're on the final lap in Phoenix. Great pulling away. That contest could be the race for second. 23 starts for Taylor Gray in the Arkham and Art Series. Could this be the magic one with so much emotion on the line to play out here? There you see a battle with Raja Karuth and Sammy Smith, but it's Taylor Gray out front racing with heavy hearts into Phoenix. They leave Phoenix a race winner. And cars are spinning after the checkered flag. The 13 of Souza. He'll cross the line in 12th, tires smoke emitting. But man, what a day, what a race, what a win for Todd Gilliland's team that became what David Gilliland built. And now it's coming to four as a team in contention with Taylor Gray, the driver for the Sioux Chief Showdown. And for as many races as Chad Johnson has on his schedule with this young driver, it's coming true here. 30th time those guys played together and now have won in the Arkham Art Series. And as you saw that yes. celebration up on the pit box, it actually felt a little bit more like relief and just a big sort of exasperation, knowing what they had been through, all the struggles this week, uh, the heavy hearts, losing a team member. Johnny Taylor Gray does the best thing he can do. The best way for a racer and for a team to heal is to go out and do your job. Taylor Gray does it, and he wins his first National Series race. There's just so much emotion right now in the David Gilliland Racing Pit. What's this mean to you guys right now after the week you've been through? It means everything. You know, this is for Stephen and uh, his family. You know, they're, uh, they've been in our hearts and prayers all week. It's been a very, very tough week, but, uh, you know, Michael back at the shop and, and John and, and all those guys, man, the team really pulled together to, to get out here and get a car out here. And, Taylor did a great job and um, just couldn't be prouder of this race team and uh, just so happy. And, um, you know, Stephen's family is watching this race and this is for you guys. An agonizing week for this entire race team, but it ends with a win here in Phoenix. Back to you. A tough fought victory. Let's first off, let's talk about those restarts. What was it like having to, to battle off some really tough competition there two, three times there in the closing laps? Yeah, it felt like... Uh, I feel like they didn't want me to uh, to win tonight, man. But you know, all those guys, you know, really tough to to beat. And uh, you know, he's had a really good race car tonight. Chad Johnson, all the guys back at the shop, Jeremy West, Ed, Aaron, Nick on the top of the on top of the stand, Frank. You know, everybody that goes involved with this program, man. Wow, what a fast car. Uh, I, you know, I. The reason we're here today is because of Stephen, Michael, and, and John. I don't know why we'd be here if, if we didn't think they'd want us to be here. And, uh, you know, this is for them. This is all for them. And, uh, yeah. We saw the emotion on your pit box. David Gill and Chad Johnson embracing afterwards. You pointing to the sky, getting on top of your car. What does this mean? Can you put it into words, what, what this means, this moment right here? Uh, man, I don't know. I don't really know how to describe it. I just, this is just for Steven, you know, and I, I feel like he looked over me today and, and, and helped me get this win. I just, I mean, I'm holding up, I'm trying to hold back not to cry right now, but just for those three guys, man, I love those guys like they're my brothers. Every, every one of these guys are my brothers, man. I love them to death and just, uh, we got to go back and just keep working, man. You can hear the applause. Congratulations on a hard-fought victory here in Phoenix. Thank you. All for Steve and Michael and uh, John.